Hello friends, welcome. Now in this video I'm going to work with uh, projects edit and delete. In the previous video we worked with uh, skills and the same thing we are going to do with uh, projects. So let's go in the VS Code and now I'm going to go here in the skills and copy the links we have here. Okay, and let's go in the projects index and paste that inside here when we have the edit and delete. Okay, now we need to change the skills to be so. Let's select all when we have skill here and change the project. Okay, so this is going to be the project the road projects edit and the project ID and this projects destroy the method delete as a button and type a button. Let's save and let's go here. And as you can see, now we have the edit and delete here. Very good. We need to create also the edit page here. So component, I'm going to save the create as edit. So let's save this as a edit component. Okay. And we have skills. We need also the project to define here is going to be an object. And let's go also and open this uh, project controller. And here when we have the show I'm going to remove and when we have the edit I'm going to add the project dollar sign project so road model binding and here we need to get all the skills so the same thing we have on the create let's copy and paste it here oh sorry Copy again and paste it here. Then we need the return, return, inertia, render, and we need to render that component. So inside the projects, we created the edit component. We need to render that and add props for project. And also skills. Okay, let's save this and let's see now if I click here. Skills. I'll refresh again. Controllers. Oh, yeah. Sorry for that. We need to add. Scales like this, and now refresh, edit. Yeah, we are in the projects three, edit. I want to add the name here, the URL, and also the skill to be selected. So let's go to the edit. We have this one, and I'm going to say here, the same thing we have done for the skills. So const props is going to be able to define props. And now we have the project as props project. Assign the name to be props dot project dot name. The same thing for the skill ID and for the project URL. So let's say Copy that, paste it here and paste it here. This is not going to be name, but skill ID. And also this is going to be project URL like this. Let's save it. And yeah, if I refresh. And also this is uh, Laravel by default. 
Okay, now everything is good. Let's work when we update. And as I said, we need to uh, work with the inertia here. So let's go and import the inertia. Import inertia from inertia.js inertia. And here now we are going to do the same thing we have done in the skills. So let's remove this and say inertia dot post and I'm going to add back ticks and say slash projects slash and we need to add the props project ID here so props dot project dot ID and then let's change the method to be method to be put and now add the name which is going to be for dot name of the image form dot image also the skill id is going to be form dot uh, skill id and the last one is the project url so project url to be form dot project url like this and we use a uh, use form but also we can use uh, reactive so if you go here as an example when we have forms yeah we can use the react in from view and create a constant for form and use that here but i'm going to do like this okay i think we are okay we added the method the name image skill and the project url let's save this and let's go in the project controller on the update here first let's change this to be a project dollar sign project so the road model binding and as i said in the pre in the previous video for the skill first i'm going to create the variable for the image so dollar sign image is going to be equal to the project image so project image okay then we need to validate the data so here we have this one let's copy that and Paste it here. Validate the image and we need to validate the name and the skill. Now the image and also the project URL is not required. So we have the validation. Okay, then we are going to check if the request has image. So let's say if the request as file image we are going to delete the image we have and update the image variable with a new one so let's say storage facade okay delete and we need to add here the project image the path and then assign this image with a new one so i'm going to say equal to the request file with name image and we want to store inside the projects 
Okay, now we have the image. We need to update the project. And let's say project. Update. And add the image. Sorry, first the name. Which is going to be the request name. Okay. The scale ID. Is going to be the request skill underscore ID project URL is going to be a request project URL and the image, which is going to be the image we have. So image like this, dollar sign image, and we are okay. Now we need to redirect here. Why we redirected the yeah, we turn redirect the project index. So let's copy that and paste it here. And let's save now. Let's go and let's see what we have. Refresh. Let's uh, say short URL one. We need to change also the store here, but and the name is updated. Okay. Let's go to the edit and change that from store to be update like this. Uh, we are not using form post now so we don't have that so let's remove this and let's see a refresh again and now i'm going to change also the image and the skill to be for example not js short url not js i'm going to say let's leave it the URL blank and let's choose the image node.js. Click update. We have changed the image, changed the skill and changed the name. Everything worked correctly. Now let's work with the delete now. And on the destroy here, we are going to say project dollar sign project. And let's delete the image first. And then let's delete the project. Okay, and we need to return it uh, back. So when we have this here, let's copy that, paste it, and save. Refresh, click delete, and we don't have that. Okay, that's it about this video. I hope you enjoy, and see you in the next one. All the best. Don't forget, if you like, like the video and subscribe to my channel.